Alright you lovely people, welcome to the channel and there you have it, how can we not talk about this when a new news about AH comes out, right? We gotta check this out. So, apparently exclusive, Amber Heard is spotted walking with a crutch while carrying her daughter Ponak as she joins her sister and family in Madrid. So there you got the picture, Amber was spotted out with the daughter 37 year old actress was seen walking with a crutch as she took a stroll and visited a lot of a local playground with her two year old daughter, her younger sister and her sister children. The Aquaman star injured her hip while training for the New York City Marathon, got a casual figure in a black camisole, whatever, we don't care about that. But, you know, alright, we've seen, we seen this already a while ago that she was walking with two crouches. And I have to say, you know, to the extent of those people just keep living their lives, honestly, I don't care. Uh, and I also, frankly, don't wish anybody to be injured. So whether or not this is true, of course, people are speculating whether or not those pictures are a gimmick to get attention to the, let's say, building up some uh, whatever tension to the upcoming movie Aquaman 2. And there is credence to that because it's, if you notice every picture has always the same company Mega which we have discussed this before which basically it's a company that you buy a package and they spread the you know very easily talking they basically do the PR for you so there is a chance that this type of stuff you know it's just to get some momentum because as you can imagine doesn't matter in, in the public eye this person is still not very much beloved right because it feels like regardless that Johnny Depp won this person got away without any real repercussion so and that is gonna linger for quite some time still I don't think it's just gonna vanish and of course you have on one side the uh, exhausting bots and the few very radical supporter of this person that keeps venting and keeps spreading misinformation every single day but i suspect that many of those again are bots literally programmed comments which they will keep doing this thing for whatever time most likely still paid by those type of companies that do pr uh, which with their internal involvement so so again you got these pictures one part of me thinks you know if you if you don't want to be seen right this cannot be a coincidence because i think if you don't want to be seen you just go to a different park right so it feels like this might be organized or maybe this is a different park and they organized the the going out so I also am actually very curious whether or not she would have gone in New York to do the marathon for real. Uh, all in all, you know, it is what it is here and uh, only time can tell us whether this is real or fake. Sometimes we see that she had braces, uh, some like patches here on the wrist. Sometimes she's walking, sometimes she's not. But it's also true that to have an injury, right, if you have a problem with your hips, uh, with your knees or whatever, it might take a long time actually to recover. So, you know, I'm, I'm willing to say that could be real on the basis of <laughs> that the, she had, the, uh, you know, the real injury to start with. Otherwise, it, it might be just another, yeah, I mean, uh, it's just another play. Seems she's pretty flexible. So I don't know if, uh, yeah, you make of this what you want, honestly. For the rest, she seemed pretty fit, I have to say. Uh, so I don't know if you have this much pain, if you're able, honestly, to carry a daughter, though. She looks pretty big, man, and heavy. So if you have real hip problem, I don't know if you're able to, to move that way. So I'm just wondering. If there are any old, like doctor in the audience um, that um, yeah could uh, dispel or confirm this so anyway we, we covered this there is not much to this anyhow uh, it is what it is it's just some gossip 
and, and it's just interesting to value whether or not this is created by PR machine or it's uh, truthful. So you let me know your thoughts on this as well. And also please consider subscribing. As you notice, I'm trying a little bit different things, but you know, most important thing, I need your support. Uh, I like your support. I'm open to suggestions. Uh, I'm also working with a, a YouTube partner manager, sort of, you know, to direct a little bit the channel because it would be nice to create something for the long run on the channel. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for the support. Talk to you later. Ciao.